exclusive club. They're members of two different groups that help change the music industry. They were here last season with the legendary New Edition. And this Thursday, you can see them light up the crowd as Belle Biv DeVoe in the Macy's Thanksgiving Day Parade. Y'all give it up for Ricky Bell, Michael Bivens, and Ronnie DeVoe. an entrance, yes, okay? Yes. And, and I'm just, congratulations, because you're, you're performing at the Macy's Day Thanksgiving Parade. Yes, yes, yes. yes. So, Ronnie, you all excited about it? Yes, all I can think about is the pageantry, right? Yes. The big floats, uh -huh. families gathering across the country in anticipation of an amazing meal that right. night, right? And uh, for Belle Biv DeVoe, it's one of those bucket list items we get yes. to check off, right? Yeah. Somebody told me that besides the Super Bowl, this is the second most watched uh, television event of the year. Yeah, wow. Yeah. That's all right. So, for them to call us and allow us to really extend on our legacy as BBD, it's amazing. I yeah. cannot wait because it's like we can remember all the songs you had. You had Poison, you had Do Me Baby. Uh -huh. <laughs> I mean, When Will I See You Smile Again? You had She's Dope. Sherry, I don't know if they're gonna allow us to do Do Me Baby. <laughs> <laughs> That one's not gonna happen. Right. That one, no, that's the song we, we know all the words to it. Right. Oh my gosh. <laughs> so, okay, so Ricky, out of, out of all of your, your catalog for BBD, what's your favorite song? Man, that's, that's, that's easy. What? Y'all help me out. Girl, you see the art. Yeah. Help me out, y'all. I apologize. Yeah. 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 And tell that's me what to do. Well. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. You'll get through Ricky. to you. I knew I was to blame. <laughs> and you know who to blame? You, I That's gotta right. pay for that. I gotta pay for that song, Ricky. That's right. <laughs> we only in our second season, All Ricky. Right. We, okay. You, you gotta okay. come, so you can sing the whole song on the I third season. I got you, season. absolutely. <laughs> oh my gosh. He was I, in the moment. I was in you the was moment. In the, and that, but you can't help but be in the moment. Yeah, man. When y'all start singing, because it's memories that come, or when will I see, tell me, when will I see your smile again? There you go. I remember breaking up with that one. He better not never call me no more. <laughs> so, it's just, so I know we get in the moment. And uh, I, first of all, I just want to say, you got your kids in the audience, Ronnie. You yeah. got Shamari, yeah. your wife, and you got the twins. You got the twins in the audience. I remember when Shamari was pregnant with the boys and they looked just like a combination of both of you. That's exactly. Sitting there. Yeah, she's oh, happy. Yeah. He's ha How does it feel being a daddy? It's amazing. We had a vision board that we put up and my wife and I, for almost 10 years, we were trying to have kids, oh. right? and we fought through a challenging time in our marriage, right? But we pushed through, and on the other side of that, our marriage ambassadors, coach, and, and therapist told us to put a vision board up. Yeah. And there was this baby we had on our vision board that mm. was like a direct combination of the twins that we have now. Really? So, the power of a vision board, everybody. Yeah. I'm yeah. telling you. Like that. Yeah. And look at that, they are so beautiful. They, they came and folded into me, and I was like, the breast is just aesthetic. They don't work. <laughs> all them boys. I love them. But, oh, like, y'all yeah. gonna all be together for Thanksgiving because, Mike, you are hosting Thanksgiving for, yes, like, everybody. Yes. Yeah. You're cooking? Well, no, you know, my mom, my wife, T, aunties, they're cooking. I'm gonna put a little dish on there. But I think for us... Um, yeah, I'm gonna put a couple of dishes on here. Cause I, I, I be cooking. Um, I just think we didn't realize it until we were doing the parade, everyone's gonna be on the East yeah. Coast. And for so many years, you would think, knowing each other for 40 years, we would've just took turns going through each other's right. house. And we never did it. And so with the guys coming to the crib 
in Connecticut, it, it's going to be the first in years. It's going to so be loud and yes. kids oh, yeah. and wives. Yes. And, and my family. kids are excited, my family. And um, we were just talking about, so do you get dressed up when you go to Thanksgiving? <laughs> like, well, Shamari likes to put us in T-shirts. <laughs> <laughs> and so, you know, and I know T, she be cooking, and she want to go up there and find a dress and stuff. So it's... It's like, it's gonna be interesting. I think all, all the newcomers come overly dressed. Yes. Right? Everybody else just be wanting to be chilling. in the sweatsuit, right. chilling. Yeah. So it, it's gonna be fun. And happy Thanksgiving to all of y'all as well. Oh my God. Please don't let me find out where you live in Connecticut, because I got 13 right. strong. They we can join you. I heard. Oh my gosh. And they, and they know how to act like they got sense. We won't, we won't like be in your face. Right. You know, and, we and just the air eat. mattresses. Right? Okay, we bring the air mattresses with us <laughs> every day. <laughs> One of the things I was so excited about, and I want to say thank you so much, because you announced your new edition, uh, Vegas Residency, right here on Cherry. Uh -huh. Thank you for that. Uh -huh. So, Ricky, and I remember asking you, like, would y'all ever do a residency? Are you excited about this? I'm so excited about this. I mean, Vegas, you know, back in the day, was kind of seen as this somewhat musical cemetery where you go after your career. Right. So. But, you know, with other artists such as, you know, Usher mm -hmm. and Lady Gaga and all these amazing artists, it's, it's have a new, it has a new identity for us. Yes. You know? This is a long day, a long day coming for us. I mean, we tour almost every year and it's pretty grueling, you know, mm -hmm. the hours, night after night in a different city. Yeah. But now we just get to park it in one city uh -huh. and people from all over the world can come and check us out. And this show, y'all is gonna be, I don't care what new edition show you've ever been to, this is gonna be different. Yes. It's gonna be something we've never, ever done before. A whole new experience for y'all, so okay. check it out. Well, all right, I love this. Mm -hmm. This is the question I have. Are y'all gonna be playing all of my songs that I know? Are y'all, Candy Girl, do not change it to Gluten Free Girl. I want <laughs> Candy Girl. <laughs> Is it gonna be updates? What does y'all plan on doing with this music? Oh no, it's yes. gonna be it's gonna be amazing. Yeah, Mike, amazing. you no, ain't saying no. No, Mike. no, I'm smiling because we we ain't gonna do that to you. Okay, all right. <laughs> all right. We we gonna officially give you the lyrics that you know. We okay, gonna switch all right. it up. We gonna do that. Cause I got I got my dances. Right. I know my dances right, to go to right. the friggin' Mr. Telephone Man is not Mr. iPhone Man. It's Mr. <laughs> Telephone. There you go. Okay, and that, you know, I don't know too many people who've been fortunate enough to be in two iconic groups. Yeah. But Mike, literally, when when Belle Biv DeVoe formed, did you even anticipate the impact that you would have on the culture? No, we we were just confident that we was gonna do something different. We knew that the new edition wore the, you know, the fifteen hundred dollar suits and we wanted to wear the Timberlands and the boots and everything. And we were working with these girls from LA straight ahead, the dancers, and they just added the power of the MC Hammer dancers, but it was mm -hmm. just four of them. And we just felt like, you know, we can individually get it off. You know, Rick could really show you how great he is. And Ron gets to sing and rap, and I get to talk and rap and start our poison, you know, which, <laughs> yes. which was a big thing for me. <laughs> there was. Talk. So it was just like, you know, how do we just be different, but at the same time, how do we influence? And then when we looked at it, we saw TLC, Criss Cross, Jodeci, Jagged Edge. We seen our R&B hip-hop infusion, and um, man, you know, they counted us out, but we got in there, we sold a lot of records, we went worldwide, and we sit here today celebrating Belle DeVoe as a, an extension yes. of the family tree, and we just want to tell y'all thank you for yeah. just rocking with us. Oh, we rock with you. We not only... We don't not only rock with you, y'all know how they say, we, we rocks with you. Yeah. Like, like we, and, and now you have, I, I, this is exciting, you have a new single with Rev Run, Act Like You Know. Act okay, like so know. Ronnie, what inspired this song? Ah, oh, 40 years of new edition, right? Yes. 40 years of Run DMC, 50 years of hip hop, and Belle Biv DeVoe being a part of all of that um, magical magnificence. And, to be able to be on the same record with Run from Run DMC. Come yeah, on, y'all. Yeah. Come on, y'all. Yeah. And really, the record is a celebration of hip hop. And we felt like, what better person to do the mashup with than Run from Run DMC? We wish DMC could have been on there. Shouts to DMC yeah. Um, yeah. as well. But it's an electric song. We took a record. Um, 
in Apache um, that really laid the foundation for hip hop and remade it in a way where we're just paying homage to 50 years of a music that people wanted to count out when it came out, but it kept pushing through and now it's a part of everything, television and all of the above. So uh, we're just you excited know, about that. This, everything that you've done, we've grown up with you. And to look out and see people who've grown up with you and we will never leave you, what does that feel like? It just it feels like a like overwhelming gratitude, right? Yeah. You see, um, like when certain songs drop in the show, you can see people's face light up like they just go back to when they first heard the song, yeah. you know. And so for us to see that when we're in rehearsals and we're working hard and we're trying to stay in shape, that's what we're really doing. We're just saying thank you, you know, by putting on the best show that we can. Thank you for, you know, paying your money for the tickets. <laughs> The babysitters, your hair done, outfits, all of it, you know? Well, I just want to say thank you so much for being here because y'all got, got some early days. And Belle Biv DeVoe's new single, Act Like You Know, it is streaming right now, so yes. please go stream it. And make sure you check them out this Thursday in the Macy's Thanksgiving Day Parade. I think I'm a brave the doggone cold and going on, out now. there.